Hey y'all, I am Luna Ray, the Gorgeous Oracle, and I'm here to do your Divine Feminine reading. Before I get into the reading, can you please like, share, and subscribe to my channel? Can you follow me on Instagram at I am underscore Justina Nicole? Everything will be down in the description box below my um below these video, this video. Um, so divine feminine. What I got for you, I have the Four of Pentacles, I have the King of Cups, I have the Moon, I have the Three of Cups, I have the Chariot, and I have the Hermit, and at the bottom of the deck, I have the Justice card. Um, Divine Feminine, I feel like somebody is holding back their feelings or emotions for you that's the secret i feel like this person has been portraying that they're good without you somebody been betraying that they live in their best life without you but the real the the truth t is that this person actually have i heard overwhelming overwhelming um it's like flow of emotions that this person never felt before from nobody. And I heard this person don't know what to do. This person don't know how to handle their emotions or this person don't know how to, um, it's like this person is clueless on, cause I have the hermit out here. It's like this person, they tell themselves like, okay, fuck it. I love Divine Feminine or um, I got love for her. I got feelings for her. So what's next? It's like somebody don't know what to do next because they never been in a real relationship to where they actually caught feelings for people. I feel like this person never caught feelings for nobody or never really been in love with nobody. Um, Usually the people that they date, I heard flings or it's people that they just go out with, turn up, dr turn up with, drink with and have sex with and stuff. But it's always been like um, no feelings attached. Right. But I feel like when it comes to you, Divine Feminine, somebody don't know how to like express how they feel or somebody don't know how to just accept these emotions like, damn. It's like, what What do I do now? Should I call Divine Feminine and tell her that I love her? Should I fucking show up at her workplace with flowers? It's like somebody I don't know. Um, I just heard cope. Another message I'm getting, somebody could be coping with... Um, it's like the loss of you. Somebody feel like they lost you. Somebody feel like you don't want them no more. And this person is feeling like, damn. I got all these feelings for, the, for Divine Feminine and she don't care about me. She don't got no feelings for me. She left me high and dry. Another message I'm getting, this person could be um, slowing down. I heard slowing down or easing up off the partying and drinking because they need to do some introspection. They need to work on themselves. They need to figure things out like, what's my next step? Yes, I'm in love with this girl. I got feelings for her. So what do I do next? This page of wands been popping out a lot. Um, this is this not gonna resonate for everybody. This divine masculine could actually have a kid, and it's like somebody wants forgiveness. Um, uh, for having a kid, I'm I'm not even gonna say on you. Y'all could have been in separation. But I feel like somebody could have had a kid and they want forgiveness. But they feel like if they was to tell you this information, you would like still leave them, shut them out, not forgive them. Somebody, they feel like you're not going to forgive them.
This, yeah, this page of wands. Yeah, it's like somebody wants forgiveness for what they done. Somebody now is, it's like they taking accountability or they see what they did to you. They see that they, um started a lot of drama divine feminine you could have had words exchanged with your divine masculine the karmic other karmics his family members his friends divine feminine you could have actually got into it with his family friends the karmic and everything and then on top of that he was you know messing messing around with different females and shit different people and it's like his, I just heard his past is coming back to haunt him. Another message I'm getting, somebody could have probably had a one night stand. They could have went out drinking and stuff and, you know, had sexual intercourse with somebody they didn't even know like that. Or it could have been, you know, just a fling. And from them going out drinking and stuff, they got this person pregnant or this person saying that, they, that they're pregnant. Another message I'm getting, somebody could be saying that they pregnant to um get divine masculine back. As in, somebody feel like this is wrong, you did me wrong, or you think you're going to leave me. I'm just good enough for you to go out with and drink with, but... Um, I'm not good enough for anything else. I got you. So somebody could actually be telling the divine masculine that they're pregnant and they really not. Another message I'm getting, somebody is telling the divine masculine that they're pregnant just to keep him away from you. But I feel like this person, another story, this person is not pregnant. Somebody is being petty, tit for tat. I don't have the option card out here, but I feel like somebody always treat whoever said that they pregnant. This person was one of many, but this person always feel like they were better or they had um, a better shot at your divine masculine, like submitting to them and being with them. But the truth is you somebody was just like a fling or they didn't fuck with this person like that. If this is a karmic, um, somebody was holding money, hiding money from the other person. It was a lot of fuck shit going on. And I feel like it's, this information was revealed. Somebody could have found out how your divine masculine really truly feels about them. So now they saying, okay, bitch, you thought you was going to play me. You thought you was going to play me. You thought you was going to leave me high and dry. You ain't leaving me high and dry, baby. I got some for your ass. So somebody was like, okay, how am I going to get this nigga back? Got it. I'm pregnant. Yeah. You ain't going to Divine Feminine. Not on my watch. Yeah. You know, that's how somebody is. Um... <sighs> Lord. It's like they playing games. Somebody playing games with the other person, Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine, this is another message. Somebody, this Divine Masculine is petty as fuck, right? And it's like he's coming up with a master plan. Okay, Divine Feminine. This is the team. Um, It's two people. The Divine Masculine and the Karmic. The first message... Somebody could be telling your divine masculine that they're pregnant because they feel defeated. Somebody, yeah, somebody feel like, you know, they was going to be together forever type shit. And I feel like this shit was revealed that somebody don't even want to be with them no more. I heard distance. Somebody been acting distance late, distant lately. Um, And then another message I'm getting. 
Divine Feminine. I feel like your Divine Masculine is so motherfucking petty, right? Um, It's like he's running out of things to do to get your attention. So, he came up with an idea for you to find out that he had... That he have a baby. I don't think it's true. I don't feel like it's real. But I feel like somebody could be trying to make up that they're pregnant to hurt you or to get a reaction out of you. Divine Feminine. Another message I'm getting. This could be you going out, turning up, drinking, hanging out with your friends. And you not paying this person no mind. And they don't like that you're not paying them no attention. So somebody is trying to figure out, okay, what the fuck can I do to get Divine Feminine's attention? All right, I got it. I'm a t she gonna find out that I have a baby. It's some shit. It's some petty shit like that. Another message I'm getting: somebody feel embarrassed. Somebody feel as though. They acted like a child when they were dealing with you. This is another message I'm getting. Somebody is realizing like I wasn't on my grown man shit. I was acting. I was being childish. I was being childish. And Divine Feminine always handled herself with class. or handled herself as a grown ass woman. And I started all this drama. I was doing all types of fuck shit. I was very inconsistent. I was ghosting Divine Feminine and doing all types of stuff to her to hurt her feelings. And now somebody is in love. Somebody feels defeated. They don't know what else to do to get your attention. Divine Feminine, this is another message. Somebody is coming forward to you soon. Um, somebody coming forward to you soon. Somebody, I feel like their way, another thing they came up with to get your attention or... To, somebody wants to talk to you, right? And I feel like they're going to come into, they're going to be friendly with you because they don't know where they stand with you, right? I heard proceed with caution. Somebody's going to, this is about masculine is going to proceed with caution. They're going to portray, because I have my communication card, they're going to portray like, hey, you know, it's been a while. Maybe we can go out for drinks and talk, you know, to catch up on things and catch up on life. Somebody can't figure you out. Somebody is tired of trying to figure you out or trying to find information on you. And I feel like it was an epic fail. So they saying like, you know what? Fuck it. I might as well just go to the source. You know, I've been trying to figure out what Divine Feminine is doing, who she been talking to. Do Divine Feminine got a baby on the way? <laughs> I feel like somebody, they just clueless and... It's like they want now they want to come to the source and ask you, like, hey, what you been up to? Or do you mind if I take you out for drinks and for lunch? You know, this is gonna be real friendly. You know, I ain't trying to do nothing to you. You know, I just want to catch up. I still want us to be friends. Divine Feminine, you could be dating somebody. or da Divine Feminine, you could be dating people. I feel like you're not um, happy with the people that you're dating or your options. Um, This for some Divine Feminines out there. You could be dating people. And this is a warning. I feel like the people you're dating, you're not really happy with them or their or your options. It could be a fire sign that you end up talking to, or you could be talking to a fire sign now. Um, this person plan on like moving around. I feel like this person is just uh 
this person is temporary. But you could actually start liking this person or something. But I'm here to tell you this person is just temporary right now. Another message I'm getting, this divine masculine, he actually have options right now, but he feel like you messing around with somebody else. You, I heard, you know, you having sexual intercourse with somebody else. Somebody is concerned about who you giving your body to, what you're doing with your body, who you showing your body to. Somebody is concerned about that. Another message I'm getting, somebody is jealous that you're not showing your body to them or you not divide them. And this is a side message. You used to, uh, it's some divine feminists out there. I feel like you used to send this picture, this person photos. And this person is disappointed because it's like they don't have no photos from you. Or they miss your body or something. They miss. They miss uh, you sending them pictures. They feel like you sending pictures to, to somebody else. Or they feel like you're doing something with somebody else. And you should be doing it with them. Whatever this is. But I feel like somebody is in their head. Like they just thinking the worst. Yeah, this person is just thinking the worst because y'all not together. So it's like now, it's like, oh, oh my God, what Divine Feminine doing? Who she's with? Who she having sex with? Who who she's giving her body to? Oh my God, what if it's her neighbor? What if it's somebody got more money than me? More? What if it's somebody that's more stable than me? You know, it's like somebody is just um just thinking the worst. They just being negative. They being a Debbie Downer. Another message I'm getting, Divine Feminine, I feel like this Divine Masculine, they could be learning or reading up on Twin Flames, Divine Masculine, Divine Feminines, the Twin Flame journey, spirituality. Somebody's coming across some uh, new information or Divine Feminine, this is you. I have one, two, three. I have three major arcana. No, hold on. One, two. Yeah, three. Four. I have four major arcanas out here, right? So, um, and I have justice at the bottom of the, the deck. So, I'm going to say five major arcanas. It's definitely... um. This person's going through some type of awakening. This person, it's it's like stages with them. This person has always been like awakened. I ain't gonna say always, but I want to say within within the last six months to a year. I feel like this person has became awakened, and I feel like every six months or so, this person like stumble across. Like spirituality or it's like they get um, downloads or something from spirit or they see stuff. They could be on YouTube and next thing you know, they could be watching um, like sports or something. And as soon as they scroll to the next video or like scroll on their homepage, they see um, what are twin flames. And your person, this divine masculine is like, hmm. What are twin flames? What is that? So this person, I feel like your divine masculine will watch the video. And then after that video is done, they see what is a divine masculine. So he click on what is a divine masculine. And then he put two and two together like, hold on, wait a minute. Am I the, the divine masculine? Because this shit sound like me. You know, it's like somebody is coming into this awakening and it's like they putting the pieces to this puzzle. I just heard that. 
This Divine Masculine always knew, Divine Feminine, that you were special, but they didn't understand, like, why, how, where the fuck did Divine Feminine come from? Like, I just fell in love. I ain't never been in love with nobody before, but this girl is really special. So, I feel like this person on the internet, browsing, uh, because I have the Hermit card out here, and it's like, little by little, what are twin flames? What is a divine feminine? Why do the runner run? So he'll, he'll uh, read the title. Hmm. Who is the runner? What do they mean by why would the runner run? So once he watched the video, he like, holy shit, this is me. I feel like this divine masculine has come across all types of information when it comes to this twin flame uh, journey. So, um, that's all I got for this reading, Divine Feminine. Thank you. Bye-bye.